Also new tonight, the Salt Lake County Council passes a resolution supporting the state ban of conversion therapy. The council says this type of therapy should be banned, especially for minors. ABC4's Brittany Johnson live in studio with reaction tonight. Well, Emily, LGBTQ advocates I spoke with today say this is a big step in the right direction for their community. Five Republicans and four Democrats voted unanimously, encouraging lawmakers to ban the controversial therapy, which has been linked to higher rates of depression and suicide attempts. Today was a phenomenal day for the LGBTQ community. Troy Williams, executive director of Equality Utah, applauds the actions taken by the Salt Lake County Council. A resolution passed unanimously by the Partisan Council urges the Utah State Legislature to protect minors and place a ban on conversion therapy. Today, the Salt Lake County Council sent a message of hope to LGBTQ kids, telling them that you belong, that you are special, that you're born perfect, just as you are. Conversion therapy attempts to change the sexual orientation or gender identity of LGBTQ people. Numerous mental health and medical associations have linked this sort of therapy to suicide and depression. Arlen Bradshaw, one of the sponsors of this resolution, agrees. If the action today can save one young person from taking their life, then it's absolutely worth it. Amy Winder Newton is the other sponsor of the resolution. We want safe and healthy and effective therapy methods for our kids in Salt Lake County and conversion therapy does not meet that requirement. The efforts to pass a conversion therapy bill this past legislative session fell flat. Its replacement bill never made it to the House floor. The people of Utah, both conservatives, liberals, they're kind, compassionate people. And when we know better, we do better. And so I know that the Utah lawmakers will take the right steps to protect kids from the dangers of conversion therapy. Now, a signed copy of the resolution will be sent to the governor and all legislators who represent the constituents in the Salt Lake County. Now, the council hopes lawmakers will take this resolution into consideration and pass a bill next legislative session banning conversion therapy. I think after you hear all of this, you wonder, so what's next? What are they going to move forward with? So. The advocates I spoke with today say the fight isn't over. They're, you know, they have a lot of things that they want to accomplish. They want to bring lawmakers and everyone to the table before the legislative session and get everyone talking about what laws need to be passed to help protect um, those in the LGBTQ community, especially the children. Most definitely. All right. Thank you for your report tonight, Brittany. All right.